Hey, what's up, y'all? We're back on the Long Venter, and today I'm going to show you every single flower location that allows you to talk to the flower vendor and allows you to get the farming hat. Okay, so here we are at the first location. You can actually find four of the flowers in this one place. Uh, this is Mrs. Snow's outpost, and if you don't use the boat, you can use the satellite locator. You can go 24 south, 5 east. You can find the king cup, the wind flower, the hepatica, and the wheat. Here you are just a little bit northeast of that location at 21 South, 9 East. And you can find the blackberry bush right here. Okay, at this location, just a little bit further northeast of that at 14 South, 14 East. There's one spawn here for raspberry bush. At this next location at 6 South, 18 East, we can actually find two more of the flowers. The first one's right here. And this is the Mezzarones bush, which is the red one. And then a little bit northeast of that, we can find sugar beets. And if you go directly northwest of this location, there's two spawns here. The cloudberry bush, which is the yellow berry. Once you got all those flowers, you make your way back to Mrs. Snow's boat and you want to head to Sergeant Lake's outpost. I'll show you that now. Okay, here we are at Sergeant Lake's outpost, and before we do this next step, you need to sit at this campfire and get your health back. Okay, once we got our health back, you want to follow this exact path that I take. Um, you only need four energy bars to make this cross, but you want to come to this point and go straight out. Uh, you want to swim straight across this water and just follow this exact path that I take. A little tip while you're doing this, when you get over to this ridge, it's going to come up a little bit you want to follow this this coastline because you're going to save some energy if you do this right so once we get up to this ridge we're going to walk up a little bit and you're going to see we can actually run you want to just follow this all the way around and here we are pulling up on my base we have a triple base set up me and my two buddies and as you can see we're making all of our money with these black lotus plants um also at this location at this spawn there is three different flowers if you couldn't find them at the other spot. But the next step you want to do is you want to get full health and come to this point right here. And make sure, this is very important, that you have full health. Because where we're going, it's going to take almost all your energy to cross this point. So let's get full health and then make sure you follow this exact path that I take. I actually showed this in another video on how to get the black lotus and the poppy. Um, if you haven't seen that video, make sure you click on that. Okay, we're back at full health. I'm going to pick up this campfire, and we're just going to run straight out. Trust me, this is not going to kill you. Um, I thought the first time this was going to kill me, but you just want to go straight out from this point. And you're not going to see any land, because usually this beachhead, you can't see anything. And I explained this in the other video, but if you just swim straight across, you will find this other beach. I'm not going to cut this out, because I want to show you that I did indeed swim all the way over here, and you're not going to die. But once we get to this island, the poppy and the black lotus are going to be at the very top. And for what I know right now, there's a little bit more locations for the poppy. But this is the only black lotus spawn. So here we are at the beach. Now you want to run straight forward. And you can see right here, the black lotus and the poppy are spawning. And this is also the peacock location. But you want to come around this ramp, come up here. And boom, there we go. Poppy and Black Lotus. Oop. And make sure before you cross back over, you need to get full health. But, if you look in our book, there's 11 plants. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And I'm going to show you now, that since you have all the flowers, what you can do at this vendor. Hey, full health, making our way back across just to show you again, I did in fact make it over with three bars of energy left. This is why we built our base right here. If we ever get ready, we can go straight over and find those black lotuses. But now, after we got all those, you want to make your way back to Sergeant Lake's outpost. Okay, same strategy like before. Follow this coastline. You're going to get to this point. Go straight out. Okay, we're at the vendor spot now at Sergeant Lake's outpost. And since I have all 11 of the flowers, you can now talk to this vendor. And he sells you the farming hat, which is what you're going to need for the next video on how to make the most amount of money. Also, another thing that this guy has, he is the guy that sells the turrets. And the turrets are 16k. 
And I'm going to show you an easy way to get this, and it involves these black lotus where you can sell for 400 each. If this guide helped you out, make sure to hit that subscribe button because we're going to be covering this game a lot, and I'm going to be giving a lot more time.